2020 was a roller coaster of a year for everyone, especially students. We've been doing this new normal for a while now, and who knows what will happen next. But knowing how to adapt and grow will make you ready for any challenge at hand. Hi, this is Steve from College Express, and here are some tips on how to make adjusting to big changes easier. It's difficult to set standards in the midst of a pandemic. Before this all began, we had deadlines, and they were either met or they weren't. When the pandemic began, for some high school teachers and college professors, sticking to deadlines was still hard and a fast rule. But for other teachers, they offered leniency to students, knowing everyone was having a difficult time. The system worked reasonably well for those students who felt unmotivated during COVID-19. However, just like everything else, getting back on track will require some tinkering since this has become the new normal. None of this is meant to undermine the value of mental health or taking care of yourself. This is not to condemn those relaxing and enjoying themselves over the summer. It's simply to say it's time to get back on track and buck up for the upcoming semester. While this major challenge has come upon us, the world hasn't stopped turning. The educations we've privileged enough to receive and the important work we've been doing, whether it be at a job or raising our voices for what we believe in, never lost importance. Now that we've had time to process the situation, it's time to learn to push ourselves in this new normal environment. Professors and teachers are changing their curriculums and finding new modes of teaching for the sake of providing us with a quality education. As students, we need to be meeting them halfway. If before meant showing up to class, now it means turning on your camera, asking questions, and meeting deadlines if possible. It may feel like more work, but it makes all the difference. On the other side, professors should be willing to accommodate their students for the classes in which this is possible. They should check in with their individual students and try to get to know them in their situations. This allows for a relationship that ensures both sides are clear about expectations and realities. If one student is particularly struggling outside of class, the professor will know how to set up a standard for that particular student. This has always been a helpful way to run a classroom, but now it's imperative. To sum it all up, both teachers and students should be looking out for the interests of the other, and that way this will be able to help us with the new normal. If you like this video, make sure to like and hit that subscribe button. Also, click the bell button if you want to know when the next video goes live for a notification.